Hello, I'm Hodan Kane, and this is my video on how to make an enchant hybrid sorceress. The beginning stats for a sorceress are 10, 25, 10, 35. If we use those numbers, excluding dexterity, we'll end up with 20, 25, 20, 70. For this particular sorceress, we, we don't need dexterity. We'll continue this until our strength reaches around 60 to 80. Continuing to use those numbers, 10, 25, 10, 35. Again, skipping dexterity. If this is your first sorceress, it's probably best to get your strength around 80. Uh, and then later you can use a token to redistribute your stat points and so you're not wasting any stat points. But I'm going to stop at 60. If you use this method, you'll find that you will have the required strength necessary to use any item that you pick up, especially if it's a sorcerer's item. Now that our strength's at 60, uh, we'll continue um, this method, but only putting points into vitality and, and energy. 10 into vitality, 35 into energy, back and forth. The only downside to a hybrid sorceress is that we have to spread our points out into two to three categories. And in my case, I'm using all three magics. But in the end, a hybrid sorceress is generally uh, the most flexible. They aren't necessarily damage oriented, like a pure lightning sorceress, but more combo oriented, like a static field before you throw a frozen orb. That's a nice little combo. I believe in the end you'll end up with about five points. Yep. Okay, with those five points, you can put them into pretty much anything you want. Okay, now let's distribute our skill points. Going to the skill point page. You'll have, at level 99, 110 skill points, if you make it to level 99. We'll put... 20 points into warmth. And if you're playing on hardcore, I'm sure this will come real handy. And warmth is a synergy for enchant. So um, we'll put 20 points into enchant and one, in, one point into fire mastery. Moving on to lightning. One point into every lightning skill, just for now. Moving on to cold. Now for the cold skills, I put one into frozen armor. It's very handy and works well with hit recovery. Work your way down to frozen orb, 20 points. And cold mastery, 20 points. If you reach level 99, you'll end up with about 11 skill points left over to do whatever you want with. And from there, if you are going... For damage, you can put them into Fire Mastery, or if you're a hardcore player and want to stay protected really well, I suggest putting them into Telekinesis as a synergy for your energy shield. Telekinesis and energy shield are often dismissed and overlooked by a lot of people, and together they are very powerful. When it comes to energy shield, it's a synergy you want. If you're not sure what telekinesis does as a synergy, you can check it out online. It's very handy. I set my frozen orb as F1 on my left click and static field as F2 on my right click. Lightning Nova is a type of stunning ability, and I set that as F3. Teleport is F4. F5, F6, F7, and F8 are for my frozen armor, energy shield, thunderstorm, and enchant. I get a holy freeze 
mercenary or a prayer mercenary, and I enchant him. And that's basically the stats and skills for my enchant hybrid sorceress. The next video will explain items and mercenary equipment. Thanks for watching.